you didn't subscribe to my channel yet then click on red button for subscription then click on bell button to receive latest notification hello friends today i am going to teach you long designer dress which is long starting from neck till ankle length and length of it is 58 inch this is my fabric kept in two layers now i'll fold it in four layers like this and do drafting of dress after folding we mark all the length from top first is shoulder length that is 7.5 inch waist length 14 inch plus half inch is equal to 14.5 inch hip length 22 plus half inch is equal to 22.5 inch and total length is 58 inch so i am taking hole in which our folding is also included now in width wise take half of shoulder to shoulder width plus half inch that is 11 divided by 2 is equal to 5 and a half inch plus half inch is equal to 6 inch mark 6 inch width wise at shoulder length 2 and also half inch less and join these marks to upper mark Now at shoulder length take 1 by 4 of chest plus 2 inch that is 36 divided by 4 is equal to 9 plus 2 makes 11 inch mark at 9 and 11 inch Come at waist length mark take 1 by 4 of waist plus 2 inch that is 30 divided by 4 is equal to 7.5 inch plus 2 inch makes it 9 and a half inch now join waist marks to chest mark in a parallel manner it is the same drafting like we do in simple kurti now come to hip length mark take 1 by 4 of hip plus 1 and a half inch that is 40 divided by 4 is equal to 10 inch plus 1 and a half inch is equal to 11 and a half inch now mark hip marks to waist mark in a curve manner like this After that at total length take half of half bottom circumference plus 1 inch and join the mark to outer hip mark in slant manner Half bottom width is 42 inch its half is 21 inch plus 1 inch makes it 22 inch mark it and now join marks in slant manner like this after that do front and back arm round curving and take neck width to make slant shoulder line neck width is 6 inch and its half is 3 inch mark it and draw slant line
Cutting is done like this. Also cut the extra fabric in bottom. After that separate back piece and do cutting of front armhole curve. After cutting of long dress. Now in stitching we sew this lining fabric with net fabric and we make the bottom part of long dress from this fabric separately. This is my back piece. Now we place lining fabric below it and do drafting. For drafting fold lining fabric in 4 layers and in width place it till chest mark. This measurement is 11 inch so I will fold this fabric till 11.5 inch. Now at top we only want the net fabric and also want to make deep V neck so I will take 6 inch margin from top. And from top our waist length is 14 inch so mark 14 and a half inch because I will do stitching a bit on upper side. Extend the lines. and also mark alongside the drafting this is required fabric we need to cut Now separate one piece from this and place it again on front neck fabric piece and do front armhole deep cutting. In stitching first we fold lining fabric a bit like this and sew it simply at top and at bottom of both pieces. After doing this, I'll teach you how to adjust and sew it on net fabric. Now we do stitching starting from one armhole including the straight line till other armhole. After that, do side stitching and bottom straight line stitching. Like this, we attach this lining fabric on our front piece as well as on our back piece. After joining lining, now we make front and back neck which I already taught you. It is simple round and V shaped neck. After that, I will join shoulders and then we will proceed further. After completing front and back neck, 
now we do side fitting stitching till bottom Like this we do on the other side also and after that I will fold the bottom. After that from top measure the required length that is 58 inch. Draw a straight line and fold the remaining fabric. After folding, I will sew this designer lace alongside the bottom circumference. Now sew this lace at the bottom circumference like this. After sewing it throughout the bottom width, do sewing on the top of the lace also. After completing this, I will join sleeves. After joining sleeves, we make a line skirt or petticoat for bottom skirt which I already taught you. After completing all this, I will upload a pic of it. If you like this video then hit like button and if you are new here then subscribe for more such videos. In the next video I will teach you a new cutting or a new stitching in a simple way. Thank you.